happy times. I'm in London, nobody cares. But Hull City, what a game that was. What a, well, I mean, what a game. One, the best of games, but what a final few moments that was. Welcome back to the Hull City Fan Central YouTube channel, where I'm just wandering the streets of London, absolutely jumping, screaming, happily mad. Um, <laughs> um, Jacob Greaves, what a man, what a man. That's our captain. He's one of our own, and he's only gone and rescued three points that was dropping down to dropping down to the single point for City for a moment there. What, what a, what a man, what a club, what a time to be alive it is for the Tigers. As I'm just trying to cross the street without dying. <sighs> um, I mean, where do I start? The first half was really solid. It was really good. Um, I was very impressed with our first half performance. I thought that. The lads put out a good shift. Um, I thought that Greaves got his first goal of the season. I was happy. It was a volley, top corner. He was trying to unleash his in the Jaden Philogene. Um, then we sort of held out. We put off Thomas, who I, who I said yesterday in yesterday's prediction video, he's going to be a big threat. He was, and we managed to put him off. And we put him off for pretty much the entire game. He was getting frustrated. He got a yellow card for through frustration. Um, it's fantastic. Our first half performance, defensively sound, um, attackingly, we looked oh, we looked promising. Second half rolled around. Um, we sort of took a back step, trying to play a bit more defensively. It was working until like the 91st minute where Huddersfield scored and he was like oh crap um we've, we've lost out on two points here we're only getting the one here from from uh, Derby Day in Yorkshire but then Jacob Greaves the cheeky man he goes and grabs his second goal of the game a brace from a centre half brace from our captain a brace from a man who hasn't scored this season yet but he scored two now and what a, what a, what a man what a man I could kiss him if he was here but I'm in London He's in Uddersfield and he's running right here in Uddersfield. Um, absolutely fantastic. I'm just wandering around the quiet streets so nobody will think I'm an absolute idiot sh shouting about a man called Jacob Greaves. Um, so we'll break down a few more moments in the game. Uh, Tyler Morton was subbed off halfway through the first half after picking up uh, what seemed like a double muscle injury. Uh, we'll be updated on that one. I'm pretty sure soon. Hopefully it's nothing too bad, but of course we do have Seri back, um, and he was in attendance this game. I uh, wasn't in the bench or starting a lineup, but he was um, at the game. Saw the fantastic performance. Uh, saw the fantastic win. It ended up to be. Uh, so hopefully, if Martin is out for a little bit of time, which hopefully he's not, Seri can fill in that role. Um, then also Billy Sharp went off at half time. It seemed to be a stra strategical one. Can't speak. Um, <laughs> for him going off uh, with Nero Ohio coming on. Really impressed with Ohio, really impressed with Abdul Shamer. Um, someone just running past me. Um, thought, it was a, thought it was a really, really good uh, performance from both lads. I will break it through the uh, the players I can remember uh, because I'm still in ecstasy. My heart's beating 165 miles per hour. I'm gonna either pass out on the streets of London or I'm gonna go into overdrive and start running laps of London. Um, so goalkeeper wise, uh, I'll stop. Um, I'm going to give him a green card. I thought he put out a good performance, made some cr crucial saves, across the goal. Seems to be his fault a little bit again. Seems to be an easy shot that he could have saved. Um, but won't put it too much against him because he did seem frustrated about that one. Um, more than the one that he let in in the fourth minute against Rotherham. Um, but yeah, so give him a green card. That was another strong performance from him. Just one error, basically, that's all it is. Um, back, back line. Um, the starting back line. So Ryan Giles, green card. Don't think it was as good as he performed against Rotherham, but still a good performance from the lad. Jacob Greaves. He gets the gold card, don't he? <laughs> Has to be. Has to be. Um, our star man, he's one of our own. Jacob Greaves, he's one of our own. Um, Alfie Jones. I'm going to give Alfie Jones an amber card. He did make a few a little bits of silly errors. Um, nearly, one that nearly cost us a goal uh, if Alsop wasn't there to sort of put his body on the line and stuff. Um, so a few silly errors from uh, Jones. So an amber card, but a bit of a weak one at that. Um, Louis Coyley came on um, and I thought it was okay. He's got some hamstring problems, so a bit of a touch and go one with him. So I'm going to give him an amber card. Um, Regan Slater, thought Regan played really well, uh, saying that he's filling in that right back spot for the majority of the game again. Green card, Mike Jacobs, he came on. I'm going to give him an amber card, didn't see too much of him. Um, doo -doo 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 -doo. Um, 
who else who else uh too fan too fan i thought he played quite quite nicely at moments he seemed to be a little bit lackluster going for like second balls or going for the going for the challenges so i'm gonna give him a, a, a green card but like a lower end green card um alongside him well you got you got philogene green card he was unlucky not to score right at the end there um one shot Get pretty much one-on-one -on -one with the keeper but he was one-on-one -on -one with the keeper um <laughs> you took the shot on the, on, honestly, this is the closest you can get to scoring from a ball coming off the post without scoring. Honestly, the ball hit the post, dribbled across the line and just narrowly went out. Amazing uh, that that didn't go in. So, unfortunate for him, but I'm still going to give him a green card. That was a, a nice performance from him for the most part, defensively as well. Um, Billy Sharp, I'm going to give him an amber card. We didn't see too much of him, and I don't think it was really his game to, to play. I thought Nero Ohio, when he came on, really, really took a shine to it. So I'd be surprised if Ohio doesn't start a game within the next sort of week or two. Um, so I'm going to give him Ohio a green card. Uh, and Asta Rory, still not the best we've seen from him. Uh, amber card, really need to see more from him. Um, alongside that, you've got Fabio Carvalho. Carvalho was good. He got subbed off in the second half. Um, still need to see a bit more from him to really be um, sort of up to that standard of Philogene. Um, of course, Philogene is running right at the moment. So I'm going to give Carvalho a green card, but similar to uh, Tufan, I believe. It's going to be like a weak one. Um, who else came on? Greg Doherty. Doherty. It's an interesting one, Doherty, at the moment. He seems to be playing a bit more of an attacking... Um, Attacking style of football, which I'm not minding, but it's just not resulting in too much of a profit for City. So I am going to give him a green card. It's going to be one of them weak green cards, um, as I've said. But just want to see a little bit more from Doherty. Um, certainly if he's going to take on that more of an attacking, adaptive role. Um, who else? Uh, Abdul Shamer. Fantastic once again. He was the cross that resulted in Jacob Grease's second goal and obviously the winning goal for the Tigers. So uh, he's going to get a green card. I think he's fantastic. Another one like Ohio, where if he doesn't start within the next week or two for a full game, or certainly the majority of the game, I'll be very... Oh, someone's honking the horn. They want Abdul Shumar to start. So he has to start. You're listening, Liam. You're listening. Abdul Shumar needs to start. Um, and I'm probably forgetting somebody that's come on. Um, I think I am. Do, 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 do. Yeah, I probably am. But that's it for this video. Make sure you like and subscribe. Party hard tonight, lads. Oh, we're on the up. Four wins out of five. That's promotion form. We're coming. We're coming. I might be back in Wembley. Just a few months' time. At the stadium. Wembley Stadium. Hull. Player final. And who knows? Miracles can happen. Adrian's the man. Liam's the man. And this squad. It seems to be it. Jacob Greaves is one of our own. Make sure you like and subscribe. Follow me over on Twitter to get live today on everything Hull City. Hand up those tigers. Yes, go on.